everyone and welcome back to another unboxing. I have the Allure Beauty Box for the month of February to share with you. I just cut it open and I'm anxious to get right into this box. So this is probably going to be like a Valentine's edition. Let's hope. Let's hope it is. Uh, if you are new here, I do want to welcome you. My name is Arlene. I do lots of different types of unboxings, some hauls, some collaborations. Um, there is one giveaway still going on that ends on Sunday. Um, so on February 11th, it ends. I will leave that information down in the description box down below if you want to enter that giveaway. It is a collaboration, so multi-channel collaboration. And if you're interested in that, you will have to be publicly subscribed to everyone in the collaboration. So great giveaway. Um, so I am so excited for this box because we got to select a lippy. Yes. So these are the shades there that you could have selected from. And I think I got the darkest one. Maybe I got the brown, but I think I got the rosewood beet. But let's double check. I'm going to look at that first. This is from E. St. Laurent. And the packaging. First of all, it's in a gold box. And the packaging on the lippy. Can you see this packaging on this lippy? Yes. It is so cute. And I'm a package kind of person. Um, so this is the... And isn't it, it's just, you can see the YSL there. Can you see? Yes. Burnt. So I got the brownish, supposed to be that brownish colored one there. But it kind of looks like it's almost like that last shade. Maybe not as brown, but let's just see if we can just put a little bit on. I got a, a gloss on right now that's like a... And I can't really tell. It does have a, not a scent, like a bad scent, kind of like um, a fruity kind of scent, I want to say. Let's see. Mm, I would definitely probably put a lip liner on, but it is supposed to be kind of sheer. Yep. Okay. Now... I was super excited to get that. Super excited to get that. This is a full size. The retail value on this is $43. I wouldn't pay $43. But it's, you know, it's a high-end lippy. It is supposed to be a dewy lip color. It's perfect for the middle of winter. And it is just supposed to give you that sheer finish but also keep your lips hydrated and it does have a great nice feel to the lips they are promoting their gq q box in case anyone is interested and wants to scan that qr code now we got five additional items in the box this month and we're going to go with the ahava product and this is the day moisturizer for normal to dry skin. This is also full size, $78, $78 value. The lotion doesn't feel heavy on the skin or, and it wears well under makeup and sunscreen. Hmm, how many ounces? 2.5 fluid ounces. Oh, it's sealed, so I'm gonna see, if, I'm gonna leave it sealed. Um. But it's a great, do what I have now. Oh, I'm, I'm using Kate Somerville right now, and I don't know what's behind Kate Somerville, but um, this will be going into rotation pretty quickly. It's a nice size amount, and yeah, my skin is normal. I would say normal, um, so normal to dry skin, so pretty much anyone can use this. So excited to get that. The price, we have $120 worth of stuff just in these two things. Okay, we're going to move on to the Happy Skin. This is from Lush. Ooh, I don't know. Do I Have I ever gotten anything? I think I may have gotten some soaps or something from them. Facial Exfoliator. 
So this says, in place of your usual facial cleanser, you want to massage this on once or twice a week to exfoliate while you cleanse. 100 grams. There's 26, it's a $26 value. Oh, full size is 100 grams. You get 50 grams here in the box, and the full size would cost you $26. So let's say this is about a third. So let's say this is about a $13 value, and you would get this at lush.com. This is what it's looking like. And it's just going to exfoliate your skin. I just want to see if it, yeah, you can feel the little crystals in there. Yep. Okay. Oh, it's a pineapple bromelain. So pineapple bromelain enzymes and acids unclog your pores and brighten while they slightly, while brighten and brighten while the slightly sandy texture of tegua nut powder sloths away dead cells and grime. So that's the smell that I smell. It's the pineapple. Mm -hmm. Okay. I haven't ever tried anything from Lush that I know of unless it was like a bath bomb or something like that. Um, so excited to try this. And it does have a Oh, it has a made by date of October 31st, used by December 2024, I guess. Yes. So it has that on the back. Okay. Next we have, this is from this Formula Prescott Tri Balm Cleanser Stick. This is also a full size. The retail value is $40. You get 0.71 fluid ounces of product. This is a three-in-one geranium and mandarin balm. It's supposed to cleanse, exfoliate, and moisturize. Wow. So this is what the packaging looks like. And then this is just the very clean, sleek, simple packaging there. And the twist. Okay, yeah, twist off. Oh, it smells good. So this is the balm. And it's a cleansing balm, but it also is supposed to exfoliate and moisturize. So that's what it's looking like. Kind of like a cleansing balm that's usually in a jar like this. So you just rub this, I guess, on your face and stuff. So let's see what it says. Run the stick over your dry skin and then rinse or wipe it away. The formula comes off easily while those oils leaving you feeling soft and while the oils will leave you feeling soft and smooth. So it's supposed to cleanse without water and it's supposed to leave your skin refreshed while on the go. So it has a trio of moisturizing botanical oils, carrot, rice bran, wheat germ, and Although that doesn't sound sexy, it will leave you feeling heavenly. That's what they say. So, it does smell good. It does really smell good. Okay, we're going to move on. We have... My fave, a fragrance. Yes, this is Commodity Milk. Do I have this already? I feel like I do. I think I gave these away for um, Christmas because I think I got the big ones from Bath It Fun, but they, I want to say it was the milk, Commodity Milk. So this I'm going to keep. <coughs> She's strong, y'all. She's strong. Maybe that's why I gave it a... Okay, it does say this is... Is this the Express? It just says Milk Plus. So this is um, 
bold and with the dots there it's for me and then everyone else so everyone around you will be able to smell this scent because it is the bold um, I would probably layer this some, with something like a very soft vanilla to kind of tone it down a bit but it's great for travel and guess what we're getting ready to go on travel so I don't know if that would mess with oh, this is, I don't know anyway this is what we have this is just a travel size or a sample size. I think the travel size is more like 10 mils. This is just 5 mil. Um, and the full size is 100 mils, and it costs $145, y'all. $145. Um, it will, the one thing that's unique about the commodity brand is if you don't like the bowl, they make some that are less fragrant or lighter on the scent so you you can get your choice finally in the box we have from jasmine beauty these this is the brow boss styling wax i have been enjoying the fenty brow i don't have it on today um but that brow pencil that i got from dion i went to go price it fenty is expensive y'all fenty is expensive it's cheaper if you get it on the Fenty site, especially if they are having a sale. Um, but between the eye primer and the brow pencil, I want to say it's 50 some dollars for just those two items. And then this is what this is looking like. So this is just a clear brow gel and you would just use your a brush that has like a spoolie on the end. And it just is just like it's nothing there. It's just very clear. And I don't mind using these as long as they don't leave my like eyebrows like hard to the touch. So now this brow wax retails for $20. You do get 10 grams of product. Um, in the full size, and this is a half a size, so this is only 5 grams, so I would say $10 value. And you just want to sweep this onto brows with a clean spoolie brush in an upward motion. So you kind of have that fanned out look on your brows. What do you all think of the box this month? I'm super excited for the very fancy E. St. Laurent Lippy. Um, this will definitely be going on my travel bag. I we have our brow wax. We have our tree, tree balm, tri balm, three in one cleansing balm, the Ahaba moisturizer, and then from Lush Happy Skin. This, in my opinion, is a very good box. Very good box for the price. Um, and I will leave all of the links, all the price information and the link to Allure if you're interested in signing up with them. I will leave that down in the description box down below. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought of this month's box. And I will see you all on another video. Thanks for watching. Bye.